Did you know you can go to God about anything? Yeah, really, anything. God wants you to cast all of your anxieties on him. And not only the things that are troubling you in life, so the big, big problems, but also the littler ones that you think are, uh, I don't need to go to God about this. No, God wants you to come to him about anything and everything, day or night. He wants to listen to you and to your prayers, to the things that are on your heart. And he's never too busy. God is never too busy to, to listen to you, to answer your prayers. He wants to help. He wants to listen. He longs for you to come to him in prayer and to lay everything at his feet. And when you do, God is going to answer your prayers. God is going to listen to everything you have to say and he already has the perfect plan in mind for you about everything you've come to him for. He's going to answer your prayers in one of two ways. He's going to say, yes, what you've asked for, I will give it to you right now. I'm going to answer your prayer with a definite yes. But God also answers your prayers with something else. God can also answer by saying, I've got something better. He always answers in one of two ways. And you might be thinking, well, I've heard that God answers prayers in three ways. Yes, no, and wait a while. And you're right. God does. But when you think about the two answers, no, and wait a while, and when you think about the answer, I've got something better, aren't they the same? If God answers your prayer with a no, he's going to do something different. And God's plan is always perfect. It's always best for you. If God says, wait a while, well, that's probably not what you asked for. You probably didn't say, God, I want this, but you can wait. I don't need that now, but, but later. No, when you ask for something, typically you want it now, Lord, please help me. And so if he says, wait a while, he's got something different in mind. He's got a better plan for you, which also lines up with, I've got something better. God wants you to come to him about anything and everything, day or night. He is never too busy to answer your prayers, and he will answer your prayers. Why? Because he cares for you. Because he loves you. Because you are his child and heir of eternal life. God cares for you and he cared for you so much he sent his son to be your savior who lived a perfect life for you, who died on the cross and who rose again on the third day by sending his son Jesus to do all of that for you. God showed that he cared for you, that he loves you, that he can't wait for you to be in heaven with him someday. You can go to God about anything and everything. He is your God. He sent his son to be your savior. He cares for you. Our verse for today comes from 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 7. Peter writes, Cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you. You can go to God about anything and everything, day or night. And he's always going to answer your prayers because he cares for you. God bless the rest of your week.